So 56 is a product of prime factors. So we'll just write 56 equals, should know it's in the um, 7 times tables. If you go this route, it's the quickest route really. You can go other routes. And that'll be 7 times 2 times 4. And that will be 7 times 2 times 2 times 2. Now, the second part of the question was the highest common factor of 56 and 42. Now I'm going to write 42 out as a product of prime factors. So this will equal 2 times 21, which will equal 2 times 3 times 7. Now the reason I've done that is that the highest common factor of the numbers 56 and 42 can be found by expressing both as products of prime factors and then circling numbers that have come up in both. So you'll see that the 7 and the 2 is in both um, lists and if we do two 7s we get the highest common factor of 14. So this means then that 14 is the biggest number that goes into 42 and 56. In fact, 14 times 4 is 56 and 14 times 3 is 42. That's um, the way I prefer to do this.